Good morning, good afternoon, good evening, wherever you are this is new to. And today I'm going to be bringing you the first of many playthrough videos of the decks, of the deck lists that I've put up for you previously. So I'm going to start very firstly with my most popular deck list which is the General Carnage Mill. And we're just going to jump straight into this. Now, I have changed it around a little bit from my video, but you'll be able to hopefully see the cards in there as well. And of course if you guys want a full deck list, feel free just to put it in the messages and I'll post it down, that's no worries at all. So this, this deck's been working pretty well online. Um, I think one of the fundamental changes is we've removed um, we've removed Flynamo because we don't want that anymore. Okay, perfect. So here we go. So we're playing against the Trianu list here. So I think we're just going to end the turn. Excellent. So we've got the Crystal Leech. So we've got some buff removal straight away. And if he's going to wait this out, I think we are in for an easy game here. Okay, so he's going to draw up a big hand, but that's fine with us because what we really want here, and I'm pulled out of the Crystal Leech too, so what we really want is, um, is a big hand, so we can Creeble Jester it. So I've no doubt that he's going to use his ability again. Yeah, draw a nice fat hand. That's perfect. Okay. Right, well that's obviously worked crazy well in our favour here. Definitely going to Creeble Jester. 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11. Four cards away. Straight away. We don't want him making those big gains early on. That's what Triali wants to do. He wants to build a massive hand. We're not going to let him do it. Yep. Okay. What else have we got? Oakthorn Warrior. Yep. Ambush. Okay. Good, and then I think really we'll just attach the crystal court. And we'll just end the turn. So, you know, he's throwing away one of his combos quite early on. Which I find quite shocking really. Um, ambush. Would have worked so well against me too, because all, most all my cards are defense, so... But he really doesn't know what this deck does yet. Okay. Okay, so firstly, I think we're just going to... Now, he's obviously baiting me out here with some of these cards, but... We run a lot of buff removal in the deck. So I think we'll be fine. Okay, so who's going to Triano and just heal me for nothing? I wonder what he's digging for. Now we've got Swamp Creeper to get Jester back in. Okay, and he's gonna oh he's he's gonna root singer, but for one card, for tree sprout. So I think we're just gonna draw. We're gonna pass two here. Hmm. So far, not really hitting our. Um, hitting our uh, our mill cards but I mean I'm pretty happy if he's just gonna oh, another blacksmith right okay so we're just missing everything at the moment um, which is pretty frustrating I have to say um, do you know our gem roughs are nowhere 
what have we got in here? Uh, one Jester and one Crystal Leech. So he's probably thinking, I don't even know what's going on. You know, we've just got this Trianu that's just drawing and drawing. Um, I'm reluctant to to drop in the Swamp Creeper to put Creeble Jester back in just yet, you know. Here we go. Okay, so he's starting to play some cards now. You might be able to get some actual value out of these. So we're just going to remove these. And we're going to end turn and draw one. Hey, finally, 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 we hit a gem rough. Oh, man. It's, uh, it couldn't come fast enough. And our opponent here is drawing left, right, and center now. I have no idea what he's actually, what he's actually aiming for. I think this time we're going to take the Corvid Conspiracy. Damage. Because I just don't see the point in removing it. I may have to drop the... The Crystal Mazes is worth. The Oak Thorns are... Okay. Oh, excellent. We, we've hit one of his buffs. Removals. That's really good. Um, I could Necrophant in... Hmm, I could only Necrophant in one at the moment. So I'll just pass the turn here. Obsification. Yeah. At the moment, we don't have any Creeble Jesters, so there's not much we can really do with um, Creeble Jesters. Uh, any um, Varbreath Creebles, so there's not much we can do with that at the moment. So I think we're just going to sit here and just, just hold out and uh, and wait to see what we're actually going to do. Okay, okay, big combo is coming out. Going to put the Vol Vine Lash in. So he's going to force a juicy play, but I think we're just going to match him. Right there, with a Shadow Puppet. And we're just going to draw an end one. And we've got another Shadow Puppet as well. Okay, great. So we're quite on top of this. As you can see, we, we, we run loads of buff removal in this deck. Um, so he's going to heal me. Thank you very much. And you can see now, 12 cards left. He's really, really running out. Of uh, of things to play. We, on the other hand, are doing pretty good. There we go. We finally, finally hit a vile breath. Um, right. Okay, so he's playing down some big cards. Do you know, I think we're just going to hold out. I mean, what does this do here? Um, no, do you know what? Let's kill him. We've still got one more Shadow Puppet left in the deck anyway. Hopefully, he does use Reckless Spirit, and I'll be able to uh, to finally use... No, he doesn't. Okay, so this is going to be a bit of a weird one here. So we're going to ditch the Apocalypse. Yep. We're going to play Gemruff. We're going to ditch Obfuscation. Yep, okay, he's going to ditch Singing Blade, and we're going to get rid of a Moss Ridge. Okay, eight cards left in his deck. Fifteen cards in total. I think we are looking pretty savvy.
Okay, and he's put the Var Breath back in, so... I mean, I'm just going to play that right down again. And turn and draw one. Probably going to Necrophant. An emergency system here. It doesn't look like he's going to... Yes, okay. Perfect. That's exactly what we wanted. Okay, and he's going to play down the Moss Ridge. I wonder if he's clocked on to kind of what we're doing at the moment. That's it. That's all three spirits gone. That means we are now safe to play our combos, our buffs, and our combo buffs uh, as we may. Though I may have discarded most of them already. Obviously, Cation, Apocalypse, and Spirits up. Yeah, they're all gone. So that means um, we've got a couple of Vile Breath Creebles now, though, that will be able to Creeble their way safely. Unless, of course, he Root Singers the Reckless Spirits back in. I doubt he will. And we did. It's a peculiar play. Um, just kind of wondering. I'm just kind of wondering what he can actually do at this point. You know, I'm sitting on 35 life. Great. So we're just going to crystal maze that. Okay, and he's starting to get a bit serious now. I can see the cards are coming down, but we are just going to... Crystal Maze, heal, get rid of Old Oak. Fantastic. Four cards left in deck. Don't want to do anything else, so... Oh, and we've got a Vile Breath. So here's hoping now we can bait out the... Um... We'll be able to bait out that, that Reckless Spirit again. I'm just wondering what his plan is. Okay, it could be Vine Lash. Uh, I'm trying to think of anything else that I removed, really. Yeah, okay, Vine Lash. So obviously, don't have the buff removal. So I think we're just going to Vile Breath. Greedy Gem Rough. Probably the emergency system here. I just just cannot see how this is gonna how this is gonna go off. Get rid of those Mantic Hatchlings, that's fine. Okay, we took a massive old hit there. So they don't really want to see. It's alright, we've got fixes in hand. If it gets too rough. Remember we've got the Crystal Core attaches, it's going to double pass. His deck is now empty, ladies and gentlemen. He doesn't have anything left. He's going to have to discard a card from play. Or from his hand. Okay, he's going to get rid of the Stump Drift. Great, now we are on him. We are on him, we are on him. So, I think the very first thing to do is to Necrophant. We're going to discard... Oh, we're going to... Put the greedy gem roughs back into play. I think we can get rid of that swamp creeper. And I'm gonna greedy gem rough. Probably getting rid of one crystal maze. We don't need that anymore. Okay, let's see what he's got.
He can't draw. He's got four cards left. Hmm. To be honest, just waiting now. You know, we're kind of on that 15 number, so no point healing with, with Fixer. So we, we haven't had to heal all game, really. He's been keeping us nice and high, pretty much negating the work of his buffs. So we're happy with that. Yep, he's playing a big combo. He's going to smack us for Feral Rage for 10 damage. And he's going to put two cards back into his deck. Okay, and he's going to draw one. That's fine, because we are going to discard that one. Yeah, we're definitely going to fix her. I think we're going to gem her off. Discarding the emergency system. Yep, he had to get rid of his fungal spores. And what's he got left? We can defeat Trianu on maximum health. Because that is how General Carnage does it. He can't defeat me. I've got Crystal Core in play. He's going to wreck the spirit to get rid of Vile Breath. That's fine. I'm just going to pass the turn right back over to him. And that, my friends, is game. And let's just see. Thank you very much, Wild Thinking. Or World Thinking, Wild Thinking. Um, good game, but there can only be one victor, and that victor is General Carnage. He didn't get that throne just for, uh, for looking pretty. So, thank you very much for watching. Uh, I hope you've enjoyed it as much as I've enjoyed playing this game. Um, yeah, hopefully I can catch you on it. So, I just want to, sh I'll show you my friend tag before I go, so you can add me. I'd love to feature you in some games. You think you can beat me, Jaeger Noon? Add me as a friend. There's my player tag. Thank you very much. I've been you too.